hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to create a custom dashboard here in Airtable let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here in Airtable I want you to click on the sign up option and from here just follow with the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Creating a custom dashboard in Airtable is a straightforward process that can enhance your ability to visualize and manage data across different tables. Now, here's one of the uh, essentials before creating a custom dashboard. You might want to go to the Airtable's interface designer platform, all right? It's a straightforward process because here you can create custom interfaces that looks great in minutes and no code required. All I have to do is just go here and if you haven't already just click on the sign up for free option now once you've done that it would be forwarded here on this home page wherein there's going to be a create plus button here at the bottom left corner wherein you can build an app with ai because code builder quickly turns your process into a custom app with data and interfaces all right i want you to click on it and here we need to create the uh, new dashboard with different data types now you might want to tell them about the app you're building but in my case for example just for this video i'm going to choose this you have all of the settings you can put in the organization gonna be um g plus this content youtube subscribers all right you can choose the color that you wanted that reflects your brand or uh, identity i'm going to choose this one because it resembles our um logo and i want you to click on next all right just wait here because it's creating all of the integration and your preferences and generating your app you see that this is how we can customize a dashboard here on you see you have the widgets the metrics layouts themes integrations you can even add your own click that you see you can add another one if you wanted now you might want to check the preview first so that you can tweak the settings if you wanted to make sure that you are on the right track because it allows you to create custom information for the uh, dashboard that you are going to create once you're happy with that all you have to do is click this create the app you see creating custom dashboard for g plus now here as you can see you have already here on the uh, dashboard it's loading up it'll take a little while and you have all the widgets here for your um disposal on the left side you have the widgets widgets timeline widgets kanban the metrics if you check that out you see you have all of this at your disposal you have the metrics name date recorded and a lot more all right the uh, themes you might want to check if you wanted um say um uh, retro arcade that's going to be primary color background image we're going to check a background image going to attach one this is going to be our um, background image so you have all this file under your disposal i'm going to add another one upload one file you see this this is going to be the custom dashboard you can find a record like laugh tracker subscriber search engagement explorer and content calendar if you wanted you can put them as much as you can here right the layouts you have the comedy central subscriber search and a lot more so you have all of this control and you can be creative because the air table offers layout options for grid timeline charts depending on how you want to present your data and again you can add widgets and chart like a subscriber chart you can add elements like numbers record list and canvas boards that pull data from your tables and of course if you use the chart right here you can visualize data with bar charts 
pie charts, line graphs. For example, they could create a bar that shows maybe um like a like average of views for a month or a pie chart for task distribution especially helpful if you're working with multiple freelancers and team members within your organization okay you can add a theme if you wanted for example this one i'm gonna name it as deep laughs primary color you can put in anything here in secondary color i'm going to choose the background image then i use my local files I'm going to upload just wait for it and voila we have already created a custom template that we can use and click on create you see that so these are going to be another um, options for you and you also have the option for integrations you see you have the youtube analytics google analytics spotify listener stats Twitter engagement and Instagram insights and again you can add another record if you wanted there's a lot of that you can work with here on the uh, custom dashboard now if you wanted to edit the app you can do so by clicking on the uh, blue button on the upper right corner and again if you want to tailor your app to team your team's workflows you might want to take a tour but I'm not gonna do with that instead I'm gonna skip it you see these are gonna be the uh, option for you you have all this you can view as yourself you can add a collaborator if you want it as you get as you can see this interface has unpublished changes right if you're done just click on done but if you want to uh add another record you are welcome to do so and you can put it here right so there's a lot of that you can work with when creating a custom dashboard now airtable integrates with various third-party apps for additional functionality which is very optional one of the best platform that i could suggest is using vagalite all right so here they can bring advanced reporting and automation features to your dashboard like this one but uh, i highly suggest this is only applicable if you have coding background or technical expertise with uh, programming all right if you do so you might want to check out vagalite and or google data studio all right we have a sub uh, we have several tutorials about google data studio that they might want to check in our channel so these are going to be your options if you want to bring advanced reporting and automation features to your dashboard now as you can see that custom dashboard in airtable are user friendly and require no coding making them accessible for non-technical team members like me to create and modify data here in your airtable account thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next video